S&P 500 index daily forecast September 10th fxempire.com the S&P index had a strong session on Friday closing at the highs and what's more important is it is a continuation of the breakout that we saw on Thursday uh, the top this four-year high here has been broken and uh, as such it does look like we're ready to continue higher certainly we wouldn't short this market there's also a little bit of a case to be made for being kind of close to the top of uh, an uptrending channel or so, uh, but the reality is that uh, if we can manage to break above uh, the highs for the Friday session, that should show real strength. We certainly wouldn't sell this market nonetheless, especially as long as we are above this 1400 level. There's a lot of different ways you can take advantage of this. The SPY, which is an ETF that follows the S&P 500. High beta stocks, uh, financials, for example. Uh, or the S&P 500 futures or E-minis. All of which should be bought in a bullish way on pullbacks that show any signs of support or just continuations of higher prices.